What is up, my friends? Welcome to Bronze the Mythic. Look what? What are you talking about? We're diamonds here too. Diamonds are forever. Episode 17, Bronze the Mythic. And uh, we're walking and rolling now. We're kind of catching a little bit of a groove here. I'm not going to lie. Starting to feel the format. Starting to feel the format a bit. It really, really, it's coming down to a lot of, do you want to be a two-color deck with maybe the tiniest splash, probably just two colors, or do you want to be a three-color deck? And it's a pretty divergent path, and I'm having a lot of fun exploring both sides. Our last deck was three colors, hardcore. The deck before that was two colors, Rakdos. Almost mono-red, honestly. So, having a really fun time exploring the format, and uh, kind of getting the groove here. Kind of getting the groove. We're ready to rock and roll, as long as our uh, eighth person shows up. As always, first time I hit that follow button, watching YouTube, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Again, I'm Jim Davis. This is my show that I do called Bronze Mythic, where I draft whatever the current set is from Bronze Mythic, and we learn the whole format together. And that's, that's what we're doing right now. Draft 17, episode uh, 17. Anything you miss is on YouTube. As always, episodes go up on YouTube every other day till the series is over. I do it for every set. And uh, let's go. Pillow Pants, I see you in chat. Yes, you're, you are here. You are here. All right, so pick one, pack one. A reminder real fast, what do you see on the overlay? That overlay there is the untapped.gg overlay. It's a draft helper. And uh, it's great if you're struggling in draft, looking to get uh, a little bit of extra help. Uh, it's sort of like reading an article while drafting at the same time. Bottom number dynamic, top number is a static rating. Let's rock and roll here. Great rare. It's funny, we had this rare two drafts ago. We actually only drew it in one game of all the of all the games, but still really, really, really good. So easy professional here. Other good cards in this pack are Mage's Attendant, which is super out, super solid. Girder Goons, Decoy is pretty good. Uh, we're sort of passing a good, mostly white and black card. I think the next best two cards. So, um... I do want to be mono red one of these drafts. I was saying that. So we'll see. We'll see how red's usually pretty open. It's probably the worst color because red's the color that doesn't really jive very well with the other colors. Um, there's not a lot of synergy between red and the other colors, except for maybe black. So red ends up being kind of like the, uh, the black sheep of the, the colors where it doesn't really jive super well. It's kind of awkward to draft. Therefore, folks don't like red that much. Therefore, red is often underdrafted and therefore it usually can be pretty open. So... Devilish Valet. Um, this card is kind of awesome. Um, the Red Sheep, if you will, sure. The Red Sheep, you got me. Um, we see a, an uncommon taken here. Pyre Sedge Arsonist is... It's fine. Uh, it is obviously good with our treasures and stuff like that, but it's really, like, only okay. Uh, only okay. Um, I kind of want to take the Valet and just give it a spin. Um does look fun. It does look fun. I'm, gonna take, I'm taking the Valet here. I'm taking the Valet. I, I don't know how good this card is. It is kind of like a, a crazy combo-y card. Uh, but Deal Gone Bad is, is... I wouldn't take Deal Gone Bad here. It's not good enough for me to want to take another color. So I think the choices here are basically just Arsonist or Valet. Unless you have a strong preference to a certain color. Uh, no reason to take a non-red card here, I don't think. Let's do it. Only Rares. OnlyRares.com. That's where we're going right here right now. Uh, well, we're not going there anymore. Uh, structural assault, not a very good rare. Not a very good rare. Um, so, we have a, uh, an uncommon and a common missing. And it's funny, I feel like I never see this card in any pack. Um, which is, and usually when that happens, when I mean, you never see a card, you never play a card, it means you're undervaluing it. But, it's interesting. Gold down's okay. There are two dual lands in here, but they're both, they're both red, but, like, we have no idea what colors we want to be yet. Um... What do we take here, actually? I would say that Devilish Valet wants us to be Cabaretti, probably. Um, rather than, like, the Grixis colors. It's, it's, it's the most... Uh, it's the most... Uh, creature one. Wrecking Crew is pretty good. I would give it a spin. I'm, take the, I'm taking Cabaretti. Take, take the Courtyard, though. Take the Courtyard. Oh, my God. What? What? What is this uncommon run? The Duelist Broker's Charm Uncommon Run. And a rare and an uncommon was taken that wasn't those. Oh my god. I mean, we're taking Strangle here. But like, what a what an uncommon run. Jeez. So, Revelers is the exact kind of card you want to play with Valet. If you wanted to go that route. But I think it's Strangle. It's just the easiest pick here for sure. Uh, right now, we just know we're red. We don't know over anything else. 
or whatever, or what other things are going to be. So, first gathering throng, sure, sure. All right, yeah, we're taking the uh, taking the strangle here. Uh, I'm going to let them fight over it. I'm going to let them fight over it. It's also possible that a good rare was taken in these colors as well. So, all right. Uh, oh, okay. Well, the red cards are gone. Sure. So now we need to decide what we want to pair red with. And of course, it's usually just allied color pairs, red, black, or red, green. Uh, Fixer is good. Fixer does play well with uh, Face Breaker and stuff like that. Um, Duelist is better at Strangle, obviously, but we have red, red cards right now, too. So the cost of Duelist is also both of our red cards. So just take Fixer here and not be very happy about it. That's what we're going to do. That's what we're going to do. All right, crew, Capitan, prize fight, and then not much else. Kind of a, all right, it's not great, but sure. The dagger is actually pretty good here. It's very good with ballet. It's good and aggressive deck regardless, but we can usually get a dagger later, I think. I think we're going to prize fight here. I think taking dagger is reasonable, though, honestly. Dagger is particularly good in aggressive attacking decks. Um, prize fight or dagger? It's definitely an interesting, uh, interesting question. I think jumping to Banth there is a mistake. Um, it's just two cards, you know, like, and you're also passing a good Banth card anyway, so I'm going to take Prize Fight. Maybe we'll, we'll explore the Gruul side of things. There's your Dagger. A lot of green cards. None of them are particularly good, but, like, it is important to note quantity. Uh, for the Family is also very good with the Valet, which is kind of a cool thing to watch for also. So I kind of like being red-green here. Even though we're not, I know we're not taking a green card here, but... The fact that green is kind of open is a nice thing to have an eye out for. So, take the dagger. Uh, antagonize Roastmaster Family. Yeah, we're going to get some of these pump spells late and try and make this Devilish Valet really good. But Roastmaster is the pick here. Alright. Uh, two drops. Initiate is just better than Socialite in every conceivable way, I think. So, pretty easy. Socialite, I mean, it's playable. We can play. We don't really want to, but... <laughs> Take that rare. Give me those gems. Give me those gems. Um, Warm Welcome or Rocks Pummeler is pretty interesting. I think it's Pummeler. Warm Welcome is... I don't, I don't really want to play either one of them, but... Socialite, sure. We got a beatdown deck here, that's for sure. Is it good? I don't know, but it's funny. I kind of want, want a second quick quick draw dagger. To be totally honest. We're grueling. Ooh, that card's really good. Uh, this card's awesome, but whatever. We have Jewel Thief here and Torch Breath. Probably just Jewel Thief though. This card's way too good. So pretty good back for us. The Fixer will probably table, hopefully, because um, Venom Connoisseur and Torch Breath are probably both better. Um, Venom Connoisseur is kind of cool with the valet because it gives a death touch and trample, but uh, I think it's Jewel Thief here. Jewel Thief is just uh, pretty awesome. Um, yeah, sure. Ooh, Getaway Car. Oh my god. Look, what is this pack? Getaway Car, Connoisseur, Jewel Thief, Plasma Jockey. Woo! Um... We just took Jewel Thief over Connoisseur as a right to do it again. Like, and it's funny because Getaway Car is actually kind of cool because, like, we bounce our own creatures over and over. You can keep triggering our our stuff. On color duel, sure, whatever. It's not, it's not as important when you're only two colors. Um, oh, shnikes. It's probably just Jewel Thief, but, all right. All right. Good news is green does seem extremely open. Oh, Nightclub is so good. Um, Civic Gardener. I don't think Briefcase does anything for us, honestly. So just Gardener here. Gardener's solid. I like Gardener. Um, yeah. Splash the Clubber. No, I don't think so. Just take the two drop. Keep it aggressive. 
Second dagger? I'm in, honestly. I'm totally in for second dagger. Uh, Fixer or Racer's Ring? We don't really need the duels in our two-color deck, and Fixer is like the best possible two-drop, so fix it up. Socialite, Glittermonger, ready to rumble. None of this is particularly good. Now that we have like two Jewel Thieves and a Courtyard already, though, I think Revelers is actually like on the menu. Um, I kind of like that, actually. I don't know if we're going to play it or not, but... Oh, yeah, we're going to want to antagonize, but they always come really late, so... Fixer again? Sick. Uh, let's say we're not playing these Socialites. Horse Master, Jewel Thief. Yeah, I don't think we're playing Pummeler. Uh, this deck would slam a stimulus package, I think. So we have one, two. We have five two drops at present. One, two, three, four, five three drops. Dagger's really good in this deck. So, Revelers is a maybe. Um... Interesting. Interesting. There's your antagonize, which I'm pretty about. Um, I'm in. I'm in. Keep it aggressive. Devilish Valet. Would definitely love other Strangle. Probably a pack three uh, consideration. Glittermonger is just, like, not aggressive enough, I don't think. Like... If we already had, like, a, the enchantment that makes tokens or whatever, sure. But we're just, like, an aggro deck, I think. Uh, Magician is fine. It's not great. It's fine. Plasma Jockey is the nut. But now we're, like, a little heavy on three. You might, like, just not play the ballet, honestly. We don't need to force the ballet into our deck, you know? Second Antagonize... Or a dual land. Uh, the thing is, these duels are much worse than the tap duels. I'm taking the antagonize. All right, sure. What? I'm sure. <laughs> now I got a lot of antagonizes. All right. Now I got a lot of antagonizes. Socialite, sure. Pack three. This is Lord Xander. Damn it. Uh, this pack's terrible for us. There's nothing. Nothing. Actually, Brass Knuckle wouldn't be the worst in our deck because we already have two other equipments. But still pretty bad. Still pretty bad. Sticky Fingers is fine. Um, I guess we have three fixtures. Yeah, Fingers is pretty good here. Fingers is pretty good. Fingers is pretty good. Mr. Oreo at the valet. Does that even work? Yeah, I'll just, just take the, take the uh, Sticky Fingers. I like it. Right now we're at... 20-ish play. I'm not playing three of these. I don't know playing two of these, honestly. But... Yeah, probably not playing the Valet. Um, it's actually pretty solid, though. We got Security Rocks. Light them up. Light them up's not very good in our deck. We have nothing to sacrifice. I would love a red-green duel. I'll take that here. Rocks is fine. It's just like a 5-4 five, four for 4, which is totally reasonable. We can occasionally play it for cheap if we're, like, really looking to do it. It's fine. All right. Uh, easy strangle over rocks here, though. Rocks is fine, but strangle is, like, exactly what we want. So, easy strangle. Deck is looking cool. This is what I was saying. We're, like, our last deck was, like, this, like, full-on three-color deck. And this deck is just, like, straight two colors. Just good commons. Hopefully we'll table this fixer again, because we got another Jewel Thief, which is insane. We have, like, too many Jewel Thieves, I feel like. We don't have anything to ramp into, you know? Jewel Thief. Uh, ooh, this is tough. Connoisseur is really good. This is a good removal spell, so let's just take the Professional. Let's call it in. Call it in. Uh, these cards suck. Honestly, Pinions isn't necessarily bad in this deck, but I don't think we're going to play it. All right, so finger strangle antagonize. 
I mean, even just antagonize plus valet is like pretty easily to end trample damage, which is kind of cool. It's kind of cool. This is 23. Uh, how many twos is this? We have one, two. We only have five two drops, which is not enough. Might need to play one of these socialites. For the family is actually pretty nice here. It seems better than antagonize does, honestly. I just love one mana spells. Um Yeah, sure. I also want to play like 15 lands in this deck too, so. Press Knuckles. This card's fun, but uh, I don't think they're playing any of these cards, so. Yeah, I think Valet's going to stay in, probably. I don't think Valet's going anywhere. This card's terrible. Cabaretti Initiate. Kind of plays with the, uh, the Pump Spell theme, but I don't think we're playing that. I guess this card's, like, not, like, heinous. Uh, oh, yeah. Woo! Bingo. Fix me up here. All right, that we we needed that bad. That's the extra two drop we were looking for. Also, I think this is more of a two color format or three color format. I think it's both. I think it's both. Um, I think you want to be this, or you want to be full on three colors. Uh, I think that's the way to do it here. Full on three colors and all powerful cards, or two color linear this. All right, so. Jund? No, come on. You're drunk. Get out of here. Alright, so we got 25 cards. We have... Now that I have this for the family, I might want to play another creature. Oh, this is antagonized. Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to play I'm gonna play one of these socialites. They're not great, but like... I have each one of the two drop. So you have four, five, six. You have seven two drops. One, two, three, four. We have seven three drops. Seven two, seven threes, two fours. Uh, we have four pump spells, two removal spells. Sorry, th three removal spells, four pump spells, and a sticky fingers. Done. Easy. Easy game. Play one courtyard, split the lands evenly, right? We're a little heavier on red, but we need the green early too, so. Revelers is not... You, folks... Yes, I understand that Revelers can splash itself. No, that's not good. Because spending 7 mana for a 5-3 that makes a token is not good enough. Is not good enough. At all. Car would be great in our deck if we can cast it. If this card costs red, green, 3, it's in. But it does not. So it's not. Uh, professional. Thief Dagger. Yeah, I'm pretty happy here. This is easy 15 lands. Like, easy. I played 14 before I played 16 in this deck. Uh, easy 15 lands. Get the nice ones in there. And 7, 7, 14, 15. Easy game. Simple. It is Gruel. So, there's a count against it there. But deck looks pretty solid. We have no rares. Or, I'm sorry, we have a rare. We have, we have two rares. We have Facebreaker and Valet. And uh, it's time to place your bets. You, place your bets. Twitch, place your bets. YouTube folks, take a second to pause the video. Scroll down. Leave a comment in the comments. Are you a believer or a non-believer? Like the video along the way and subscribe and do all the things you can do. And uh, message your grandma, do all your things. And that's our deck. And this I this is a cool one. I don't know. This is a pretty... It. I feel like it would be hard to get a better Gruel deck than this as far as like raw aggression goes. So... Let's see how it goes. I'm I'm pumped. You should be too. Place your bets. All right. Non-believers. We got the gruel haters in chat. I understand. I understand we got the gruel haters. I get it. I get it. Hands great. Keep. You can straw land, but whatever. We got, we got stuff. We got stuff. Fixer. Fixin. Do it. That was a mistake. I should have cast social. Whatever. Uh... Servant. Okay, cool. That works, too. We draw a land. Alright, so... We just, like, jam. Try and get a quick draw dagger out of him. 
Actually, they, they, it's Miss Pumps anyway, so they, they would never do that. Uh, in for two, Socialite Strangle. Keep it simple, stupid. Draw land, play Security Rocks. How many you got? I swear to you, I've never seen more than one in a draft. All right, they just have two. Right, that makes sense. So they got insanely lucky to get two. I get it. I get it. Um, easy attack. I would love to quick draw Dagger of the Throng here. Dagger is really good in this deck. Like, really, really good in this deck. Uh, next turn, Magician, make two tokens. Get him for a, a bunch. There are two in draft 13. All right, you got me. You got me. Throng. Throng, 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 throng. Um, am I willing to... Yes, I am actually willing to do everything here. Play this, make a token, and trample the shit out of my opponent, because we got four creatures in play. This card's good for the family. I like this card. Slam Jam. They're going to block Fixer. We're going to plus four, plus four. Oh, it's not Trample. Oh, they get Trampled, too. I'm sorry. Whatever. It's not as good as I thought it was. Um, it's okay, though. Maybe now we just trade, actually. I screwed up. I made a mistake. I'm sorry. That's uh, it. I'm going to clown college. Uh, uh, it's fine. Made a mistake. Made a mistake. It's my fault. I take full responsibility for my actions. Don't play Elspeth. That's good, too. It works out, though. It works out. So now I play this. I play Fixer. Attack. Oh, shit, it doesn't work. Man, I suck. I only have one green. All right. I got a little excited. All right. I'm going to take a second. I'm going to take a breath. We're good. We're good now. All right. Everything's good. Don't worry. I'm just, I'm just too gruel right now. I'm just getting gruely. I'm getting gruely. All right. I thought I had two green. These lands are too hard to see. I, I'm too old. We're good. We're good. Obviously, I wanted to play that attack in for, for the family, but like I couldn't. So should have just played the, uh, the rocks, but... Plus four, plus four for the family. Which thing gave uh, gave trample to? That'd be sick. That'd be sick. Final count, 40-60. 40-60. Chat, come hang out with me. I need your help. Regulator. Crowbar. Sure. All right. We draw the forest. Okay. Um, this is, like, fine. Let me just attack... Trade with Citizen, probably. Resub. Thanks so much, Saren. Yeah. Could, in theory, pump twice on Fixer, but... That makes life difficult, I think, so... Sure. Play Rocks. And put the Dagger on the Rocks, I think. So we can get through the Agitators. These lands are great. I just I just screwed up. Ugh. Man, card quality here, Jesus. All right. Crowbar on the educators. Not good. Not good. Um, we can also only pump. Oh man, I I just like completely botched this game. All right. Um, it's so bad. Tax keys. Sure. Pump. Pump. Sure. It's fine. Play land, equip, say go. Now we're like pretty behind on cards, but them's the breaks. Them's the breaks. Eighteen to thirteen. Our fixer is the best creature on the board right now. So thanks for following Dark Wolf. If you haven't followed the stream with that follow, but of course, watching YouTube, make sure you like, comment, subscribe.
Five bucks a month, folks. YouTube membership or Twitch subscription. Best way to support me, not close. What do you get? Holiday card every year with a signed token and a signed foil. A disciplined duelist when you really didn't want to see your opponent play it. Uh, fantasy hockey, fantasy football, free prizes, free entry, Discord, all sorts of stuff. All sorts of stuff. All right, so let's see. Absolute monster. Uh, three, four, five, six, seven. Jeez. Why are all their cards so good? This is what I was saying, though. There's like the two color decks, the three color decks. And the card quality of three color decks is definitely higher. Um, every card they play has been insane so far. Uh, but, you know, the mana might not work and so on and so forth. Um, I can trade for the family for their shield counter. That feels awful. Uh, just gonna say go. Just gonna say go. And their deck is good. Their deck is good. They're just a monkey too, you know? Take two. Uh, that card's like not that good, but it's really, really good here. So they draw two, they draw two cards a turn now. God, we're under so much pressure to actually kill them. Oh no! Call a professional off the top, please. You gotta call somebody. That that also works actually. That's a really good one. All right. Um, all right. Ship it. Attack step. This thing can't block. This card's so good. How many of do we have? We have only one jockey. Line up your blocks, if you will. Friend. Yeah. For the family! Get my rocks back? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Um... Yeah, pump this too. Ship it. Boom, boom, boom. Down to six. Get back my 5-4. The dagger stays here. Still with this rigged app. What are you talking about? Strangle? That's good. We like that too. We're doing it, folks. That was a sick draw. That was a sick draw. And that's the that's the problem with this wiretapping card is that like you throw two cards a turn, the turn you cast it is devastating for you typically because you just fall so far behind. We have three pumps on fixer and strangle lined up, and face breaker. Oh, we're we're doing it now. All right, um, let's start with the strangle. Yes, no, maybe. They have a lot of cards in their hand. Oh, no! No! Hello, Devastating. Devastating turn of events. Alright. That's... That's bad. Alright. Um. Play Face Breaker. I guess we can, like, still attack with everything and just, like, try and get our treasure and, like, we'll lose one thing if they want to double block, but we get a treasure and, like, some damage through. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Hopefully no kill shot, too, here. That would be just devastating, but... Uh, okay. Okay. They have more tricks, don't they? Oh, they have the they have the, they have the thingy. Sure, that's I mean, I'm I'm played like I've played like absolute shit this game. I've played like absolute shit this game, folks. What is going on? That was horrible. I forgot the freaking uh the thingy. All right, sure, it's fine. It's okay. Bad play, champ. Bad play. <laughs> I just forgot they can kill my my dagger. Just totally forgot. 
Uh, all right. So I'm I'm doing it right. I'm playing gruel and literally drooling all over myself. Um, we're good. We're good. Their deck, their deck is really, really good, but... Um, man, we played bad this game. We played bad this game. Facebreaker. Alright, untap and draw. Need some help. That's not help. How about this? Is this help? I can't complain. I played horrible with this game. I, I can't even complain. About our 15 land deck. Can't even complain. Their deck is pretty good. Their deck is pretty good. What? I'm glad I played bad this game. I would have lost anyway. I mean, I probably, I probably would have won this game if I played well, actually. But, alright. Uh, yeah. I guess. We draw a fixer. Uh, yeah, two force. Oh, we're just dead. All right, you got me. All right, you, you, you win. You got me. You got me. I played horrible. I tap out. Your deck's great. I'm dumb. You're smart. I don't lose a rank, though. That's sick. That's lucky. Oh, man. Tighten up. Scrappy, crappy gruel. Got to tighten up here. Got to tighten up. This is not the kind of deck where you can... Uh, was a good boy and your memorial brawl deck of him was wonderful. Oh. Thanks, Dark Dubs. That's very kind of you. I appreciate that. Thanks so much. Thanks so much. No two drops. We gotta keep, but... Alright, so... Really wanna draw one of my seven two drops. Drooly grooly. There it is! Bingo. Now our hand's great. Now our hand's great. Tap lands galore. Lo Ooh. Do we sticky fingers here? The fear with sticky fingers is that if I go for sticky fingers and they have like a pacifism or a bounce spell or something like that, then I lose a... Uh... MB Jam, that was you? You have Broker's Ascendancy too? Get out of here. Get out of here. No, you don't. Inconceivable. You game, my friend. Uh... But it is like... I don't see a good go in here. Well, just, just give it. Just, just do it. We didn't come here to not do it, right? Attack. Good game, Jam. Good game. What can I have here? Oh my god. What a massacre. What a massacre. It's so hard to play around these, because, like, you don't expect them to cost one, you know? Alright. Alright. Sure. It's fine. It's fine. It's gonna be alright. It's gonna be all right. It's gonna be all right. Look at my boy. In for three. We're still in decent shape here. Security bypass. Yeah, whatever. I guess if they can knive a, a counter onto it here, it's kind of gross. But we just race them, right? Like. I don't care about them walking. Oh, that's that's not a blue white card. <laughs> Rocks pummeler, sure. For the family, sure. Uh, if we like, hmm. what are we doing here? What are we doing here? We obviously don't want to trade with the veteran. I think we roast master strangle, honestly. I don't care about shield counters, whatever. Because we have the jockey next turn. So next turn we jockey the regulator, can't block anyway. And we have throw the family for the kill, so. Take in for eight here. They're at 11, and now we just have like jockey family kill you. This is plus four plus four too, so this card's great. Still doesn't stop the, uh, the family being plus four plus four, they're at 11. They attack too? That's aggressive. They're dead, right? 3, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 4. Yeah, but we have 14 damage this turn, folks. 14 damage. I 
a last alliance of citizens and elves. Game. That's more Analysis. like it. Scrappy crappy, all right? That's more like it. That's more like it. We're good now. We're good. I had to get that first game out of the way, and their deck was too good anyways. It's fine. Not a big deal. Fumal. Fumal. Uh, on the draw. Hands good. Hands good. How do you beat blue-white hammer with blue-red Murktide? You lose all the time? I think that's a good matchup for Murktide. I don't know exactly, but... Typically, heavy interactive decks with a good clock are good against Hammer, but uh, I'm not sure, honestly. Keeping? Probably Socialite for... Ooh, those fancy lands, jeez. Do the fancy lands. Do the fancy lands. Spar's headquarters. Alright. Agent? It's fun. We, uh... Hmm. It's awkward because we... I think we actually fixed her here. Because we want a double spell next turn. We only have... We only have... We have Forest, Forest, Mountain. We can't test two red cards. So we can go Socialite Strangle. So we're going to play this. Right, Mike's got the idea. You choke down red, cast the red spell. Make sure we can double spell next turn. We might just play Magician anyway, but... I could see them playing like a 2-3 flyer of his turn, like us wanting to kill it, but also play a spell. Alright, this is definitely a kill shot. Um, yeah, we're going to cast the Roast Master and see if it's a counter spell, and if it's not, we're going to not attack. Alright, no attacks, there you go. Obvious kill shot. No? What is this? Oh, they have a... A thingy? Like a land thingy? Sure. Oh, they're like a lot of colors. Or just like, just, just Naya, I guess, but... Alright. Might have missed two damage there, but like, I think that was a very reasonable choice to not attack, so... I'm not unhappy with my choice. Attacks look better this turn anyway, so... Voice of the Vermin. We draw a fixer. Alright, it's jockey time. Jockey's so good. <laughs> Like, this card is unbelievably good. Just, like, casual 10 damage. Boom, boom, boom. 9 damage, whatever. Draw a red source? No. Okay. Okay. Now what do you got? Now what do you got? A mountain on top would be pretty good. Be pretty good. Alright, great strangle target in Civil Servant. Gotta kill that one for sure. The Vermin's coming in. Folks are just so ambitious with their attacks. Alright. I mean, they could have, like, we need to land. They could obviously have a pump spell here, which would be pretty devastating, but... We're going for it. Strangle you. Don't do it. Yes. Alright, that's step one. Step two is attack. I mean, we're gonna trade... Uh, fixer for uh, agent here, whatever. It's fine. We're not, we don't have a lot, we don't have a lot of mana to pump anyway, so. Or Roast Master. Whatever they want to do, honestly, it's fine. Thief into Strangle. That might be better. That might have been better. Oh. Oh. That sucked. They had the pump spell. It didn't save their thing. They wanted to block with this and gain four life instead. All right. That was gross. Now this is an attack for seven. All right. Yeah, I think the Venus Triangle might have been better. Now we're at six. All right. We draw Forest. Yeah, it sucked. That was not good. That was not good. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Hmm. 
Yeah, obviously our mana was not very cooperative this game, unfortunately. We kind of want a Magician just to have an extra blocker. We're definitely dead here, I think. All of our blocks are pretty bad. Oh, they, they have a pump fill for sure here also. This is how they're going to attack. They're just, they're just like slamming the attack button like this. They definitely have a pump spell. Uh, yeah, we're dead. Super dead. Yeah, whatever. Alright. That sucked. Um, just stumbled. Just stumbled. Just stumbled. Dr. F. Top 500 Mythic. Playing in the 1 tube bracket. And we don't have any lands. God damn it. Come on. Just give me a freaking forest and a mountain, you know? How hard is that? How hard is that? We can't keep this end. We can't do it. This end's got no curve. It has to draw land. Yeah. Sure. Ugh. All right. So, double Jewel Thief prize fight. It sucks. Like, we have so much mana from the Jewel Thieves, but, like, nothing to do with it. And we can't bottom a land because we need to have the third land to cast Jewel Thief. So, like, this kind of sucks, but... Alright, never mind. We're good. Now, now we're, like, now we're in great shape. Hand's great now. Because now our treasure feeds into the, into the fixer. So don't kill my fixer. Sure. It's a good card, but... You're up. Good card. Good card to have on turn two. Good blocker. Antagonize? Antagonize is good with the freaking Jewel Thieves, too. For Trample. Jewel Thieves is so good. It's a really, really good card. What do you got, Dr. F? What's the F stand for, chat? What's the F stand for, huh? Tell me. Yes, citizen. Wow. Sticky fingers, greed. Oh, no, not when I mulligan. Don't do this to me. Oh, God damn it. Should have done the prize fight, honestly. We don't got any good fights here. All right. I mean, we get the bash here. We draw a fixer. I don't hate it. It's a bop. It's a bop. Next turn we draw a Lamigan Jewel Thief and Pump. Fair. Fair. We really want... Oh my god, what is this? I mean, now we're like... Now we're just screwed. Um, we 
We like have to block. It just sucks. So they get to draw a card and make a treasure. Otherwise, they make two treasures. Oh my god, this is awful. Ugh. A double fixer. They draw land. Alright. Um. We just got a jam, I guess, right? We're never winning this game uh, if it goes long, so we should try and kill our opponent. I don't know. Sure, that's cool. I don't want to thief pre-combat because then it, make, it lets them know that they can block this fixer safely um, with the th with the thief. I don't want them to do that, so um, this is fine. I don't want to use antagonize here. I want to use an antagonize to kill them because we are never winning this game if we don't cheese them out. We need to we need to, we need to you know get a trample attack in, cheese them out, and then win the game. If we have prize fight back again. Yeah, I mean that would be good. Sure. Obviously, I didn't know they were going to play a, a good 2-3 rare. Body dropper, sure. This thing having vigilance blows, obviously. Oh my god. You need to, you need to take it easy upon you. Need to, you need to slow down for a second, alright? And think about what you're doing. Alright? There are 12... I think we might get them. I think we might get them here. I think they're going to block the Thief on Thief, which allows us to antagonize, deal much damage. And then the Buy Dropper... Oh, it's a 3-3, three, three, it's true. That's fair. Alright, well, let's see what happens. I think I want to pump now. Save the mana. I'm, I'm saving one mana off this thing. I'm, I'm going to pump now. So now I can antagonize and pump next turn. Ooh. Okay. 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 So. Um... We kill Jewel Thief here, and we smash, and hope they got nothing. All their blocks suck. This will probably line them up blocking Buy Dropper on Jewel Thief. Don't you dare have a pump spell, I swear to freaking God. Ah, oh, great. This is awesome. Go ahead, sack it. What do I care? That's awesome. That's great for us. So, they have a 4-4, which is totally whatever. Attack with everything. What? Three, six, nine. What? Three, six, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Okay. Boom. Get out of here. So you get nothing. You lose. Good day, sir. That's what I'm talking about. All y'all saying their version of this is a good version of my deck. Get the hell out of here, huh? Huh? Can we get some F's in chat? Some F's in chat for Dr. F? More like Dr. L, huh? Huh? What? Why are you booing me? I'm right. I'm right. Oh, yeah. Scrappy, crappy gruel. Let's go. Let's go. They should be scared. Now I got good hands, too. If I have good hands, they can't win. Let's go. Let's go. Forest, go. Sure. Mountain, go. Fixer, jewel thief, strangle. Prior. Alright. Uh, double Jewel Thief? Whew. Double. We have three of these or two? We have three Jewel Thieves in our deck. Three. Four Fixers. Our deck's good. Our deck's good. Not the best deck ever, but it's good. It's a good solid deck. Sawjack. Alright. Don't want to start roasting before I start thieving? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Attack, no blocks, Roast Master go. Let's 
So start getting that damage going. They're gonna gain one life a turn, which is fine. But um, we have our own face breaker. Yes, we also have devilish valet and face breaker. Never draw them. I've had face breaker now in two drafts today. I've played ten games of those drafts and drawn it once. So as far as I know, it's not there. Venom connoisseur. It's a good card. Alliance death touch. Uh, no blocks. Jewel. Th How many like we like our jewel thieves? Uh, all right, we go land. I guess we just like strangle this thing. Just get in. Strangle thief. Start playing thieves over and over again. It's a good. It's a good turn. It's a good turn. Whatever. Do this. Do this. Hoping I have that damn color hoser card again. That would suck. Do this. Do that. Attack. Perfect. We're on the board. We're on the board. Four fixer, three jewel thief is pretty good. Oh, that's bad. All right. Well, they just found a way to make their sky crier bigger, which is very bad for us. But I think we're still sort of okay. We want to save our treasures for Fixer whenever possible. Would I trade Roastmaster for Sawjack? Yeah, I guess I would. Here, honestly. Alright, so... We could pump Fixer twice here, too, which is pretty good. Do I even bother talking to the Roastmaster, then? Maybe I just don't attack and just don't trade. They can, like, move it back and forth. They can, like, put it here, attack for three, put it here, have a 4-4 four, four blocker, though. I should show for the trade. Sure. And again, I think I want to save... Treasure for Fixer. Maybe not. Maybe I just cast the another Jewel Thief here. I screwed up. Nox, nah, I didn't matter to pump it. Nah, yeah, I screwed up. I screwed up. I think I missed a, a point off Rose Master. I should just cast Jewel Thief here. I was, I was stupid. That was wrong. I, I made a mistake. I missed a point off Rose Master because they, they still can't block the Fixer because I would sack two treasures. So, like, I thought I couldn't get Fixer in if I didn't cast it, but I can't, obviously. So, all right. Thieves. Thieves in the night. Burblo Bergen's the, the burglar. Times three. We watched the first half of uh, The Desolation of Smog last night at my pops' house. They can't, can they attack? They can attack, apparently. All right. Are they dead? They can move it. It's a 3-3? Three, three? Sure. All right. Yeah, whatever. Sure. Ho! Uh, hold on. Three, six, nine, ten, eleven, twelve... 13, 14. 14 is more than 11. So you get nothing. You lose. Good day, sir. <laughs> Keep it coming. Jewel Thief does not turn sideways. All right, here we go. Here we go. It's good. It's good. Not great, but good. Dagger on Thief is great, too, so. Pawns in a tank. Oh, they're, they're like Platinum 4. Oh, their deck's so good. Oh, no. Oh, no. Keep... Did Maul get a 6? It's good. It's good for us. I'll take anything at this point, honestly. I got no I got no shame. Gardner's good. Gardner's good. I like Gardner here. Untap a Lando. Maybe Strangle. Overseer's also good, but sure. Didn't draw land. Fingers is good though. We can we can do this. Alright, so fingers here. Now attack. Untap this. It's a good draw. And now we go we go Jewel Thief, probably, right? Just the biggest, baddest thing I can play. Do you like the Arena Cube drafts? Yeah, they're fun. Most cube drafts are fun.
In for two. No problem. Ugh. Why is today throng day? I swear I never see a throng in any draft ever. And today, I guess the, most opponents have only had two, though. So, And we have the perfect answer, which is, which is, which is quick draw dagger. So, uh, one, two, three to untap a land. Nah, we're short. We can't, we can't play everything. Um, if I want to strangle the overseer, I can. Um, if we play initiate first, we attack, untap a land. It's only two mana. We can't play quick draw dagger. If we want, if we, if we strangle the overseer, it's like super obvious what we have. Uh, so we'll just, we're going to attack here and waste the mana. It's fine. Um, we could prize fight and kill. Is, if we kill overseer with anything, I guess prize fight looks less um, looks less suspicious, but it's not worth it. I'm just gonna attack. Yeah, they block. They block every time there, every time ever. So. Get him for next time. Trample over. Trample's so nice. Make a treasure. Say go. Dub strangle here. You can you can't float mana. I would have to cast the dagger before they block, as far as floating mana goes. Because each the mana a long, long time ago in a galaxy far, far away, mana would float through the entirety of combat. They changed that rule in like eighth edition or something like that. So mana ends at every single phase. So when you go from declare attackers to declare blockers, mana pool empties. So you used to be able to do that. You used to be able to float mana through all of combat. Which would, which would have worked there, honestly. But I'd go the whole wide world. I'd go the whole wide world just to find Waldo. Um, Alright, so now we've got, like, got it all. We... Now we strangle the Overseer. Play land. Tag of both. Dagger is really good. Like, it is it is very, very good. I go the whole wide world. I go the whole wide world. Just a finder. Alright, so play initiate. So you go. Just don't wrath me. You know, like it's all I ask really. Um, I think the dagger gets moved to the initiate here. So I have two, uh, I have two, three power creatures to attack through this thing. So you go. Back streets, back. All right. Wrong. They're dead, right? I think they're pretty dead. Prize fight, strangle. Maybe not like dead dead, but they're pretty dead. Jewel Thief again. So Strangle. Um, strangle Bruiser. I guess I have the Dagger too, so. Strangle Bruiser, attack with everything. Dagger's up again. Untap the land. Gardner's great. I like this card a lot. Card's solid. Wouldn't you know it. A dagger number two. Cut you down where you stand. Boom, boom. Five. Go. We have, we have a... I actually guess Jewel Thief. That was stupid. I guess I have a Wrath. We're like pretty far ahead, but... Echo, 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 echo. They're dead. Fingers have been great. Yeah, Fingers have been very good this game. Discard the pinions, Sure. All right, so untap. Ooh, devilish valet. Um, we can make this work, right? We go valet. We go jewel thief. Ah, but I wasn't done yet. I still had prize fight. I still, I still wanted to. I wanted to fight you. I wanted to. Huh? 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 I'd go the whole wide world. I'd go the whole wide world. Just to play quick draw dagger. Keep. Hands great. Hands great. Gardener. Dagger. Rocks. Lost match one in 
three, I think. Get a red. Sego. 21. Blackjack. Swamp. Fixer. Um. I think it's Gardener over Fixer. Because they're also more likely to block the Gardener with a two drop, and then I get him with Dagger, whereas they won't block Fixer ever, because they, they won't have a three power creature. Sure. Um. I mean, they could have the counterspell, I guess, but whatever. Play it. Tax step. Untap it. Your turn. No two drop is nice for us. We, we like that a lot. Up, oh, just kidding. <laughs> you got me. You got me. That's two drop. Fair. It's all fair. Fair, fair, fair. Tron, sure. Just the old, the old basic land Tron. Discarding a, that's a boom boom. That's a boom boom. They're, they're making some moves here. They're attacking too. God, I love when they attack. They think they're safe and they have no idea. Fixer number two. All right, so we, we just dagger here, right? To so play play land, play fixer. Tag of both. Untap the land. It looks like fixer pump or gardener. They block, we dagger. Ha! Huh! I don't get mad. I get stabby. It's so good. It's so good. Blocking is not a thing. Ooh, Eckhart's good. Eckhart's good. Will they pump the brakes now? Or will they keep attacking with the berry vandal? Oh, they keep attacking. They always keep attacking. Hey, they, they, they just love attacking. They just do their thing, you know? Jockey. Attack step. Can't block. Untap uh, this land. Pump this thing. Boom, boom, boom. You're five. Dagger stays here. I mean, I guess, like, maybe we didn't need to do that. Maybe we could have just, like, got the fixers in because they can't block, played rocks, and gone for that next turn. That might have been wrong. That might have been wrong. Ooh. Ooh, that sucks. Um. I mean, rocks has got to be better than Jewel Thief here, right? Just, like, on pure sizing alone. Jewel Thief must allow a permanent pump, and it is a trampler. But it does not line up well against the auger. Although we do have the dagger too, though. I think Jewel Thief is better, actually. Maybe I'm crazy, but... Strangle. That was good. That was good. Kill this. Play Jewel Thief. They're at six? Just, uh, if I attack with everything, they block Augur on the smaller fixer, chump block the big thing, take two. But then I just, like, lose a fixer, put them to four. It's not good enough. Just look at this. Wow. I think the only card that punishes me here is the the white spell that kills a red creature. Wow. I mean, they got it, they got it, I guess, right? The no double block is pretty weird. If they, the thing is, if they have knockout blow, they want double block, because then I then I pump and they kill it in response. They, there's no way they have knockout blow. There's no freaking way. Like, it's huge double block, obviously. Yeah, like, it doesn't make sense. Like, you double block to guarantee that I pump, and then blow me out, and that's great. You know, like, the goon squad? Sure. Land is fine. 
Um, now we want dagger on trampler. And we want to attack with... I mean, it's actually attack with everything. We pump one of the fixers and then attack and untap a green source. Feels pretty good. This feels pretty good. Block, 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 block. You're at three. Pump this. And... Oh, Dagon Gardner's lethal, wasn't it? Eh, I screwed up. <laughs> Whatever. Um, I'm playing Gruel. I don't think about things, all right? So we trade, kill, kill. They go to one. And then we move the dagger over to the Gardener, where I should have gone in the first place. That's fine. It happens. They cast Depopulate or whatever. We deserve it. You know? It's life. It's life sometimes. You're calling me stupid? You are calling me stupid? I'm going to make him an offer he can't refuse. The offer is... Yeah, what are you going to do about it, huh? What are you going to do about it? You're one. Wrath me. Dig up the body, sure. You're dead. You're dead. Vixer and Gardner are good together, too, honestly. Alright, get back to Informant, whatever. I don't really know what they could possibly do here, because all their... Even if they, if they like, survive this turn... Like, they did two of those? Wow. Sick. Game. Game. Blouses. You're stupid, Jim. You're stupid. Norad? Norad? Uh, yes. Jewel Thieves all day. We have, like, three bump spells, too, right? We have Antagonize for the family. I guess only two. Only two, I suppose. Play ball against the six, sure. Yeah, literally everyone has COVID. Like, there's just no escaping at this point. It's just, it sucks. <laughs> like... Ain't gonna steal my lucky charms. The gardener. Uh, I don't really want to like give any info away. Yeah, whatever. Just attack and untap it. I would like like to courtyard untap it, but like if I courtyard and they kill a gardener, it's like so bad for us that like it's just not even worth it. Can't get it if you never leave the house. It's fair. It's smart. It's smart. When oh, you're smart, you're smart. Jewel Thief. Lacking a sink for all this man at the moment. But we have four Jet Mars fixers. And we have Face Breaker, which we still haven't drawn yet. Even though this is matched like 15 or whatever. I'm telling you, it's there. There it is. There it is. It's in the deck. I swear. But it's like it's it's like so good in our deck too. It's disgusting. I drew a match one. I know. I know. Professional draw dodger. Exactly. Wait a minute. What? <laughs> Main phase. Dig up the body for nothing. Mill two lands. Say go. Sure. You gotta live your life, buddy. You have to do the things that make you happy, right? Um. Do we cast Jockey here? Can I cast Jockey and Jewel Thief? I can, right? Get a forest. Uh, attack. Untap it. Uh, no, I can't. I'm not good at math. Um, what are we scared of here? Not much. They're already at 13. Just cast Thief and just say go. Cassie Jockey is kind of nice, but just play Jewel Thief and say go. We have 3 6. We have 12 next turn. Ben says this is legit the only good Gruel deck I've ever seen in this format.
That's because it's my first Gruel deck. That's why. That's why. Hostile take over next turn. So. They might have it. They might actually have it. Um, security rocks. If they have hostile takeover, though, the dagger beats it. Because I can put the dagger on the thing. And I have two or four toughness creatures. So. Yeah, this is a pretty easy um, play land, play security rocks. Uh, with with mana, not treasures. Untap a land, have dagger up, and if they do have takeover, we win. And if they don't have it, we win. So, yep. Attack step. Attack step. We're on out of town. Sure, it's fine. We're going on top, I think. Honestly. Alright. You're at 8. Your turn. They play Hoss take over. They're dead on board, right? They have a... F I guess we're one short dead, but... Alright, cool. That was fun. <laughs> what, what are you going to do? Paul literally didn't cast any spells. And... Diamond 1. 5 wins to go. Folks, we're six and two. We're going for seven wins, and we're brought to you by... Jim Davis will be appearing at Too Many Games, Friday, June 24th to Sunday, June 26th. Prepare for a weekend full of Magic the Gathering action, including a panel with Jim and other special guests. Bring your deck for the chance to play against him one-on-one -on -one for some awesome prizes. And while you're there, be sure to check out our huge marketplace, massive free play arcade, cosplay wrestling event, tabletop tournaments, concerts, and much more. Click the link below or visit TooManyGames.com to get your ticket today. It's going to be awesome. The other people with me are going to be Brad Nelson, Corey Baumeister, Lady Livinius, and CGB. It's going to be an insanely awesome con. Uh, be there. I'll be playing. I'll be guns, guns, gun, gun slinging. I'll be spell slinging. I'll be doing signings. Uh, I, I'm going to be doing a panel. It's going to be incredible. Super, super cool. Uh, make sure you're there, right? We drew Facebreaker. We only have two land. We're keeping this. We're keeping. Why not use Treasures on the Rocks? Why use Treasures on the Rocks? Spell slinging. Sorry, gunslinging is an, is an antiquated term. It's not a. That's not. It's not a good term. It means you get to challenge me and play me, play me for a game for a prize. But spell slinging is uh, what they're calling it. Challenge game, whatever you want. Come play magic with me. Hang out with me. It's gonna be. It's gonna be awesome. Keep seven. We draw a land here. Our hands insane. We drew a land. Sick. Socialite and a breaker. Anti rules. Blue, green. Well then. You got a counterspell? What format? Um, I'll probably have a modern deck. We might have a standard deck also. We're gonna have jump start packs, so you can just play in case you don't have any. Obviously it's hard to have every format. So jump start's like gonna be the base level one, but all right. They're bant. I'm getting social though. I gotta focus. This is, this is an important match. This is a marble match, folks. I gotta, I gotta focus here. I gotta focus. We might have... I'm sure all the Pioneer deck... You know, one person on the Pioneer deck. So we'll all be swapping decks around and stuff, too. If you have two decks, that works also. It's just hard to have, like, a deck for every format, you know? Oh, we drew Strangle. Um, that was actually insane. We go Breaker Attack. And, and then they won't block, and we just Strangle. They might block, actually. If I go Breaker... Huh. Interesting. I guess if like sure, whatever. We just we just attack. If they want if they want to trade, this is a great trade for us anyway, so this card blows, so. Attack. If they block, it's great. If they don't block, it's great. If we strangle, we can't cast anything else to total waste of mana for the turn. And then if they don't block, we probably use... We might use Strangle to kill the Servant. I'm not sure yet, though. Alright, so now we decide if we want to Strangle or not. Because obviously every treasure is a card with Breaker in play. So we were, we're like kind of inclined to not want to use a, use a treasure. Um, the, the, worst, the, the worst case scenario is here they gain 3 life. But they also tap their blocker, and then I attack back. This is fine. I'm just saying go. Just saying go. 
Um, if they play a citizen here, tap tap the citizen to get in with servant, gain three. Because we have face breaker this game, as well as a few removal spells, we don't need to be like balls out aggro. If they gain three, it's at the end of the world, so. Worst case is charm. That's true. That is total that that's fair. Uh the band charm is the worst case, because it's a, it's a fight effect. Or like land, creature, pump, fight. Yeah, I guess. When you put in prize fight and Bant Charm, I think it was right to strangle. Now I think about it a little more. Why is everyone thronging today? All right, sure. Throng, throng it up here. Throng it up here. Never see more than one in a draft. Throng, to throng, throng, throng. Let me see that throng, throng, throng. You get attack or no, you coward? Come on. Pick one. One opponent today had four. Opponents today had four, two, two, and now three. Alright, nothing. Untap. Prize fight. Okay. So. Strangle servant attack. They block weak dagger. Because the thing is, like, they always want to block with this. We just dagger. We just get the dagger every time. Strangle this. Play land. Dagger up. They just block every time ever here. I don't get mad. I get stabby. Good timing. Good timing. Take it out. But Dagger is really, really good. Like, it really is an excellent card. Don't kill my breaker. This game is over, I think. Citizens? Citizens? Yes, citizen. It's a tight game, folks. Feels nice to draw a rare the last game. The most important game. Throng, the throng, throng, throng. Yep. Any more throngs in there? Alright, untap. We draw sticky fingers. It's actually a really good draw. Um So now we're gonna fingers, magician, make a token. Get in for a a, a bunch. Because now it's got a thing. Magician. Citizen. Yes, citizen. In for a bunch. You're at eight. And like, now you just have like a comical amount of mana. Uh, yeah, your, your turn. <laughs> Some Diablo 2. Some Diablo 2. We finger we finger socialites on the stream. We finger lots of stuff, all right? And our fingers always get sticky. We get it. Yes, I know. It's very funny. Very, very funny. Very, very funny. Wow. It's like there's a party in my mouth and everyone's invited. That makes it worse. <laughs> that one makes it worse. Come on now, Throng. Come on now, Throng. What do you got for me? Sawjack, get the hell out of here. You really think that that... You think that's going to win you this game? That's going to win you this game right now? You're dead. You're done. All right? You're out of here. Two, three, three, two. Um, I should actually put them as first. Whatever. I'm going to start, start doing this. We need one more toughness to kill. I mean, there's dead, right? I don't even know. Whatever. I'm just going to win the game. All right. Yeah, I shouldn't have should put land, obviously. Oh, I'm so happy. The valet gets to come in, too. Um, valet, one, three. I guess they watch move a thing there, too. All right, whatever. I'm just having too much fun. 
Um, professional, move this. This goes here. We move the thing over and then we fight and then we win. Sure. I want to cast all my rares, all right, folks? Not going to fight here anyway, so. Um, three, one, four. They're just freaking dead. All right, four, fight. I'm just making shit. We, we have lethal like 10 ways till Sunday. I'm just making shit up. I'm just like, oh, I want to do this. I don't want to do that. I, I didn't get to cast my card. All right. I didn't get to cast my card. And now I do. All right. And now I do. We have to play the valet. We got to play the face breaker. We get to take game actions. And most importantly, we got to. Wow. Get out of here. Seven wins. Shitty gruel. Believers get paid right now. All right. All you non-believers, gruel sucks. Here comes the money. Let's go, believers. Let's go. You call my gruel deck shitty? My gruel deck was awesome. My gruel deck was awesome. It was great. It was cool. It was fun. It was explosive. We had a great time. Um, um, let's take a look at it. I want to go look. I want to admire it. I want to really take a good look at it. All right. Let's take a look here. Hop on over to uh, to untap.gg as usual because untap.gg is the bomb. You should download it. Use my link because that's just how we do things here. That was great. Um, that was actually quite good. The, the real the real core of his deck was four fixers and three jewel thieves, um, providing you the ability to actually like push through stuff with trample and then the fixers able to pump, and then also providing a use for the treasures for the jewel thieves was super awesome. Daggers insane. I would have loved a second Jockey, but Jockey was really, really good. Gardener's great. Socialite's not great, but we should have two drops. It's fine. Uh, for the family, it was fine, too, honestly. Two Strangles is great. This deck was good. Just good, solid deck. Um, I definitely wouldn't look to draft this deck intentionally because I think Rule is not very good. But if you want to see what a good Rule deck looks like, this is it. This is it. So, awesome. Pumped. That's uh, episode... Is that 17 in the books? Jim Davis will be oh, appearing shit. at too many no. games. Uh, 17 in the books. YouTube folks, love you. Like, comment, subscribe. You're all awesome.